Hello everybody. So today what we are looking at is simultaneous equations. So how do we solve the intersection of two lines to figure out where both of those equations cross over? So there's two types of simultaneous equations that we look at. We can look at substitution, okay, so via substitution, or we can look at solving equations via elimination. And they both have slightly different steps that go along with them. So we're going to look at the first one um, first, which is substitution. So in order to solve an equation, say we could have um, 2x take away 3y equals negative 8, and we could have y equals x plus 3, and we're asked to solve this. What you would do is I would call, let's say, equation 1 and my second equation, equation 2. So what I'm going to do is because this is y equals something, okay, I'm going to say I'm going to sub equation 2 into equation number 1. So wherever I see y in equation number 1, I'm going to write x plus 3. So if we do that, we end up with 2x take away 3 bracket whatever y is, okay, because this is a y. So then I'm going to write x plus 3, because that's what y is, equals negative 8 to continue on with that equation there. And then I'm going to expand and use algebra to solve the rest. So if we expand this, we end up with 2x take away 3x take away 9. Okay, so expanding of brackets, we do negative 3 times x and then negative 3 times positive 3 equals negative 8. And then I'm going to solve this via algebra. So 2x take away 3x equals negative 8 plus 9, which is 1. 2x take away 3x is negative 1x. So negative x equals 1, which means x has to equal negative 1. So now that I've solved what x is, what I can do is I can substitute x equals negative 1 into, let's say, equation 2 to figure out y is. So y, we know from our equation, is x plus 3, which means it has to be negative 1 plus 3, because that's what we just solved for x. Negative 1 plus 3 is 2. Therefore, we conclude that y equals 2. So these are the steps that you would follow if you were solving a simultaneous equation via substitution. But if we were to 